For centuries, our gaze has been drawn upwards to the mysteries of the cosmos, pondering what lies beyond the glittering veil of stars. Today, the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, stands at the helm of cosmic exploration, ushering us into a new era of discovery. This marvel of technology, equipped with the most advanced instruments, is poised to unravel the secrets of the universe. But what have these new eyes in the sky revealed? How might these groundbreaking discoveries reshape our understanding of the cosmos? Join us as we delve into the revelations of the James Webb Space Telescope and ponder the profound questions they raise about our place in the universe. The James Webb Space Telescope, often referred to simply as JWST, represents a significant leap forward in our ability to observe the cosmos. Launched in December 2021, this telescope is often hailed as the successor to the iconic Hubble Space Telescope. While Hubble has served us incredibly well, JWST is designed to surpass its predecessor with a suite of advanced technologies and instruments. Equipped with a large primary mirror that spans 6.5 meters across, considerably larger than Hubble's 2.4 meters, JWST can collect more light and observe objects in far greater detail. This larger size allows it to look deeper into space and further back in time, giving astronomers a clearer view of the early universe. One of JWST's most notable advancements is its ability to observe primarily in the infrared spectrum. This capability is crucial because it allows the telescope to see through cosmic dust clouds that obscure other wavelengths of light. By doing so, JWST can reveal hidden regions of space and provide new insights into the formation of stars, galaxies, and planetary systems. The mission objectives of JWST are broad, yet profoundly significant. They include unraveling the mysteries of our solar system, exploring distant worlds around other stars, and probing the mysterious structures and origins of our universe and our place within it. Each of these objectives not only sets the stage for a deeper understanding of the cosmos, but also ensures JWST's role as a cornerstone of astronomical research for the foreseeable future. Now let's dive into the concept of the observable universe and what that really means for us on Earth. The observable universe includes everything that we can see from our vantage point here on Earth, whether through the naked eye or with the most advanced telescopes like the James Webb Space Telescope. It's important to note that when we talk about the observable universe, we're really talking about the portion of the universe from which light has had enough time to reach us since the beginning of the cosmic timeline, the Big Bang, which happened about 13.8 billion years ago. This brings us to the mind-boggling scale of the observable universe. It measures about 93 billion light years in diameter. Now, a light year isn't a measure of time, but of distance. It represents the distance that light can travel in one year, which is approximately 5.88 trillion miles, or about 9.46 trillion kilometers. To put this in perspective, imagine light traveling at about 670 million mph, which is roughly the speed of light, and covering that enormous distance in a year. So when we say the observable universe is 93 billion light years across, we're saying that it spans a distance of about 546.84 billion trillion miles, or 878.58 billion trillion kilometers. This immense scale helps us grasp just how vast the cosmos really is, filled with galaxies, stars, and other celestial phenomena, each of which could hold countless mysteries waiting to be uncovered. In the early 20th century, our understanding of the universe underwent a dramatic transformation thanks to Albert Einstein and Edwin Hubble. In 1915, Einstein introduced his theory of general relativity, which radically changed how we understand gravity. Unlike Newton's view of gravity as a force acting at a distance, Einstein described it as the effect of curvature of space-time caused by mass and energy. This groundbreaking theory led to the realization that the universe isn't static but is, in fact, in motion. This theoretical framework set the stage for a pivotal observation by Edwin Hubble in 1929. Hubble discovered that galaxies are moving away from us, and crucially, the farther a galaxy is, the faster it appears to be receding. This phenomenon indicated that the universe is expanding, a concept that was initially counterintuitive even to Einstein. The tool central to understanding this expansion is the concept of redshift. Redshift occurs because as the universe expands, the light from distant galaxies is stretched along with the space through which it travels. This stretching shifts the light towards the red end of the spectrum, hence the name redshift. By measuring how much the light from a galaxy has been redshifted, astronomers can determine how fast it is moving away from us. 
This not only confirms the expansion of the universe, but also helps in estimating the rate of that expansion. Through these observations, redshift has become a fundamental aspect of cosmological research, allowing us to peer back into the universe's history and better understand its dynamic nature. As we gaze into the cosmos, one of the most intriguing questions we encounter is, what lies at the edge of the observable universe? The observable universe includes everything we can see from Earth, measuring out to about 93 billion light years in diameter. But what exists beyond this boundary? Theories about the universe's edge often delve into complex and fascinating ideas about the nature of the cosmos itself. One popular theory suggests that the universe might be infinite. If this is true, it means there is no actual edge in the way we might traditionally imagine. Space could extend endlessly, containing an infinite number of galaxies and celestial phenomena, all interwoven in the fabric of the cosmos. Alternatively, some theorists propose that the universe is finite but without any edges or boundaries. This model suggests that space curves back on itself, much like the surface of a sphere. In this scenario, if you could travel far enough in one direction, you might eventually return to your starting point, traversing the universe much like circumnavigating the globe. This concept challenges our perceptions and highlights the extraordinary complexity and beauty of the universe. Both theories showcase human curiosity and our pursuit of understanding the universe's vast scale and form, providing a framework to explore the cosmos further with advanced technologies like the James Webb Space Telescope. The James Webb Space Telescope has once again turned our understanding of the cosmos on its head with its latest discoveries. Among the most startling revelations are the observations of six massive galaxies that existed surprisingly early in the universe's history. Between 500 million and 700 million years after the Big Bang, prior to these findings, scientists expected this era to contain only small, fledgling galaxies. The existence of such large galaxies so soon after the Big Bang poses a significant challenge to our existing models of galaxy formation. These galaxies, each comparable in mass to our 13 billion year old Milky Way, contain mature red stars, suggesting that they developed far more rapidly than any models had predicted. This rapid maturity contradicts previous assumptions that galaxies in the early universe started as small conglomerations of stars and dust which gradually grew over billions of years. The James Webb Space Telescope, through its deep field imaging capabilities, not only captured these galaxies, but provided data that has left astronomers reeling. These findings compel astronomers to revisit and possibly revise our understanding of cosmic history, particularly how galaxies and structures came into being so shortly after the universe's birth. This breakthrough demonstrates the JWST's unmatched capacity to expand our understanding of the early universe, adding depth to our knowledge of galaxy formation and challenging existing scientific theories. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, represents a significant leap forward in astronomical technology, equipped with state-of-the-art instruments designed to peer deeper into the cosmos than ever before. Among its most notable features is its suite of infrared capabilities, which allow it to observe the universe in wavelengths of light invisible to the human eye. This is crucial because infrared light can penetrate cosmic dust clouds that often obscure other forms of radiation. One of JWST's primary tools is its powerful infrared cameras. These cameras are essential for observing the early universe, as they capture images of celestial objects whose light has been stretched into the infrared spectrum by the expanding universe. This stretching, known as redshift, is more pronounced in objects that are farther away, meaning that JWST's infrared cameras can see further back in time than those of any previous telescope. In addition to its cameras, JWST is equipped with spectrographs that add another layer of observational power. Spectrographs are instruments that split incoming light into its component colors or wavelengths. This allows astronomers to analyze the properties of that light, including its composition, temperature, and motion. By studying the spectral lines in these light signatures, scientists can determine the chemical composition of distant stars and galaxies, uncovering details about their age, mass, and even potential for planets. Moreover, the telescope's use of coronagraphs, a technology designed to block out the blinding light of stars, enables the direct observation of nearby exoplanets and other faint objects around those stars. This combination of advanced instruments makes JWST uniquely capable of studying the formation and evolution of stars, galaxies, and planetary systems, 
providing a window into processes that occurred billions of years ago, only a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. In a recent groundbreaking discovery by the James Webb Space Telescope, Astronomers have uncovered evidence of six massive galaxies that existed surprisingly early in the universe's history, between 500 million and 700 million years after the Big Bang. This revelation is particularly startling because prior to this, scientists had only expected to find small, nascent galaxies at such an early stage in cosmic history. The presence of these large, mature galaxies so soon after the Big Bang poses significant challenges to our existing theories of how galaxies form and evolve. Traditionally, astronomers believed that galaxies started small and gradually grew larger over billions of years through processes such as star formation and mergers with other galaxies. However, the discovery of these universe-breaker galaxies, as they have been aptly nicknamed, suggests that galaxy formation might occur more rapidly and differently than previously thought. Each of these galaxies appears to be as large and as mature as our own Milky Way, which is roughly 13 billion years old. This unexpected maturity of galaxies in what can be considered the cosmic dawn forces astronomers to reconsider the physics of early universe galaxy formation. It suggests that significant amounts of star formation must have happened very quickly to allow these galaxies to reach such a mature state so early on. These findings not only raise questions about the speed and process of galaxy formation, but also hint at the possibility that the conditions in the early universe might have been different from what the current models suggest. Now let's look at what the future holds. As we continue to push the boundaries of our cosmic knowledge, the future of space exploration looks brighter than ever thanks to upcoming missions and advanced telescopes. A particularly exciting development is the planned launch of the Nancy Grace Roman Space Telescope, formerly known as the Wide Field Infrared Survey Telescope, or WFIRST. Scheduled for launch in 2027, this telescope will carry on the legacy of the James Webb Space Telescope by delving even deeper into the mysteries of the cosmos. The Roman Space Telescope is designed to explore various fundamental questions in the fields of dark energy, exoplanets, and infrared astrophysics. With a primary mirror diameter of 2.4 meters, Identical to that of the Hubble Space Telescope, the Roman Space Telescope will offer a new perspective on the universe. Its wide field instrument will allow it to capture images over a field of view more than 100 times larger than that of the Hubble, enabling it to survey the sky at unprecedented scales. This will not only increase our ability to observe the cosmos, but will also dramatically enhance our understanding of the universe's structure and evolution. Moreover, the Roman Space Telescope will be equipped with a coronagraph instrument, which is specifically designed for high-contrast imaging and spectroscopy of nearby exoplanets. This instrument will be crucial for blocking out the overwhelming glare of stars, allowing the telescope to directly image exoplanets. Such capabilities are expected to revolutionize our insights into planetary formation and offer new possibilities for studying potentially habitable planets. By building on the discoveries made by the JWST, the Roman Space Telescope will extend our cosmic reach, bringing us closer to answering some of the most profound questions about our universe. This seamless integration of past achievements with future potential underscores the dynamic and ever-evolving nature of astronomical exploration. In summary, the advent of the Nancy Grace Roman Space Telescope marks a significant milestone in our ongoing quest to understand the cosmos. By leveraging cutting-edge technology and building upon the foundation laid by the James Webb Space Telescope, this new mission promises to expand our horizons further, offering deeper insights into the universe's secrets and potentially uncovering new realms of knowledge in dark energy, exoplanets, and beyond. As we look to the future, the potential for discovery seems limitless, promising a new era of astronomical breakthroughs. We hope you found these facts intriguing. If you've heard them before or have any thoughts to share, please let us know in the comments below. Don't forget to give us a thumbs up and subscribe to A World to Discover to join us on our journey of discovery. While you're still here, feel free to click on other videos you will see on your screen right now.